Hi lovelies! So it's been so long since I made a video and I apologize, truly apologize. Um, as you all know, everybody's probably having like finals right now and just a lot of tests and stuff since it's almost the end of the semester. So that's my excuse, <laughs> which is probably a lot of other people's excuses too. So this video was a tag video and it was actually tagged by CBabyX. So hey girl, thank you for tagging me and shout outs to you. This is a tag that's been going around for a long time and I've just never gotten to do it and since I was tagged I was like alright let me just do it because you know it's something fun to do um, let's get on to the eight most worn things tag now the first thing is most worn lipstick or lip gloss um, lately I haven't been wearing lip gloss and I've just been wearing lipstick which is kinda weird but my most worn lipstick as of right now is NYX's Talia and the only reason I'm wearing this like a lot is because I'm trying to finish it for my Project 10 pan. Because you guys know I'm still doing that and it's taking forever. It's harder than it seems. So Talia by NYX. And but this is more of a neutral. If I wanted to go more bright, I would I love this one, which is Max Speed Dial. It's a cream sheen. And it's just like a really Barbie pink, and I absolutely love it. The second most worn item is earrings and I have been loving my Charlotte Russe like here I'll just show you they look the, like leaves and they come in three colors this is silver then there's this teal and then there's gold ones that I've worn in a video I believe and uh, I got compliments on it and I don't know where the gold ones are right now because I wore them somewhere I just throw them everywhere so I love these and they're so cheap they were four dollars for three pairs so that's awesome and I always find myself going back to these because these are really casual and yeah you can wear them every day the next item is my most worn shirt I don't really have a most worn shirt um, but the shirt that I love absolutely love wearing all the time is plain v-necks um, I'm really into v-necks right now I, I like the scoop too but I have a couple scoop necks but I really adore v-neck I feel like it just shapes my curves well if you know what I'm saying <laughs> so I have this in like bajillion colors white black green um, yellow gray and other other colors I don't know but this is from forever 21 they're like three dollars or something so they just look like that but yeah so this is my most worn sh kind of shirt not really shirt shirt the next thing is most worn nail polish right now I'm loving this nail polish by OPI. I think I showed it to you guys before. I'm not really sure. But this is called Pamplona Purple. Pamplona Purple. I don't know if you can see that. But it's a matte, like, it's not a dark purple, but it's a deep purple. And you guys know I only wear matte nail polishes. I don't know why. I just think they're a lot better than metallic ones and shimmery ones, I don't know. So Pamplona Purple is my favorite right now. Next is <laughs> shoes, my most worn shoe. They look like this, this is from Charlotte Russe. They're black with like really cute buckles and stuff like that. So I wear these all the time. These are really comfortable for school, walking to class and stuff. So I love these. These were like 40 bucks or something. I don't, I don't know. I forget. But I love these. Love, love. The next thing is my most worn hair product. I don't use product in my hair. I, don't, I barely use hairspray. I think I used hairspray like last weekend for the first time in like four years or something. Crazy, right? So I don't really use hair products. So I don't really have a most worn. But I do wash my hair. So my shampoo and conditioner. Oh wait, this is upside down. Whoops. Um, this is the Pantene Pro V Moisture Renewal Conditioner. And this one is the Moisture Renewal Shampoo. So that's what I use, and I use them every single day. Well, not every day. I wash my hair every other day because it's not good to wash your hair every single day. And then Next is Most Worn Perfume. Yeah. Okay. 
Right now, my most warm perfume is Marc Jacobs Daisy, and this is the rollerball that I got from Sephora. And I keep this in my purse, so whenever I feel kind of funky, I just whip this out and I like roll it all over. And yeah, so this is my most worn right now, and I absolutely love it. Um, I don't have the full size bottle. I would like it, but I still have this, and this is nice and convenient for me. And the last thing is the most worn purse. Okay, so this is my most worn purse. If you've been following me since the beginning, um, I did a what's in my purse video. And I actually deleted it, and then I did my new one that is up right now. But I showed you guys this purse right here. This is my most worn, absolute favorite purse of all freaking time. Not even kidding. Um, I haven't worn it lately because I'm afraid it's going to break. But it looks like this. It's gray, and it's like fake animal print, or I don't know, alligator skin-ish kind of thing. And it has a really cute floral detailing right here oh my gosh it's so pretty it has braided straps which is my favorite and double straps which is also a favorite of mine so this is from urban outfitters about a year and a half or two years ago and i absolutely love this purse and you know it's my most worn because look at the straps can you see they are freaking ripping but that's how you know it's my most worn purse and i love it and it's like the perfect size is not too small and not too big so I absolutely love this bag and I cannot find it anywhere if you guys find it somehow some way let me know because I will definitely buy it right away it is my favorite and I love it and I want another one because mine's ripping but yeah I absolutely love it so thank you so much for tagging me C baby X um you're so awesome and I watched your video and I was like I gotta do it gotta do that tag so Thanks so much for watching, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye. Okay. So, another reason why I haven't been, like, making videos is because, like, I've been really, really stressed out about... It's really sad to say, but... <laughs> guys? Yeah. Ugh. So, yeah, um, I don't want to bore you guys with, like, my sob story, but... I like to tell you guys things because, you know, a lot of you guys have experienced that. Like when I talked about my car accident, a lot of people told me about their experiences and it's nice to hear your, your stories. So, um, to keep things really simple and short, I've been talking to this guy since like summertime and then we stopped talking and then we started talking again and he's like a big jerk, plain and simple and I can't help it but like him. So we've been talking on here and there you know off and on and he invited me to go to this fraternity thing like this formal or something for his fraternity and his college is actually two hours away and I was willing to go up there because I like the kid and you know he supposedly liked me too or he supposedly still does I have no idea and so I got my dress, I got my dress at Armani, and it's really cute. Got my shoes, got my earrings. I had everything planned out. Um, my friends helped me with, like, some stuff. I borrowed the camera, because I don't have a camera, if you guys know, because I use my MacBook to record everything now. So I just went through a lot of crap, and basically I was supposed to go tonight, and he texted me tonight, and he's like, you know what, I'm just going to bartend. I'm super sorry, you're... You probably hate me. I don't blame you, this and that. And he goes, um, yeah, I'm just going to bartend tonight. So I'm like, all right. So he kind of like effed me over. And I'm like, oh, my God. I just feel like crap. And I'm going out tonight, but I still feel like crap because I really like the guy. And this is the second time he kind of like effed me over. So I'm 